people can certainly be um, helped to be more creative. We can't train people to be creative because people are already creative. Mm. It's just they've kind of forgotten. <laughs> they've forgotten how to. And I think it's really about learning how your brain works and then almost reprogramming it to mm. make it work better, yeah. which is possible. Um, mm. Well, you're rewiring, aren't you? You are. You're re rewiring it so it, it's easier for it just to have more ideas, mm. which is, sounds ridiculously like magic. It's not. It's, it's not. No, it's called simple. neuroplasticity. Yeah. Um, if you would put somebody under a brain scan mm. um, and then put them in a six-week program of mindfulness mm. or something similar, mm. after those six weeks, their brain literally looks different. Um, mm. Certain areas will have grown mm. and others will have become smaller. So it really is about rewiring your brain. And what I hear a lot from people that have done these techniques and keep doing them mm. is that um, in the beginning, it can be new, it can be a bit uncomfortable, but once you keep going with it, after mm. a while, it just becomes second mm. nature. Mm. And they feel less stressed, they feel more in control, they, f they feel more equipped. Um, mm. They don't freak out when they hit a creative block because they just know what to do. Mm. Yeah, yeah, you can move from having good ideas to having great ideas mm. when you are in charge of your brain, when you're in control of your brain, and when you can manage your stress um, with some of these techniques, you can go from having good ideas to having great ideas.